Hello everyone. Thank you so much for joining us today for a very exciting Celestial Cruises webinar. My name is Anna. I'm an Industry Relations Specialist here at CLIA, and I'm going to just quickly go through some housekeeping before introducing our presenter. The webinar will run about 40 minutes with time for questions at the end. Please feel free to type your questions into the questions module of the webinar and we'll get to them at the conclusion of the presentation. This webinar is being recorded and will be posted on CLIA's YouTube channel, which is CLIA Global. And with that, it is my pleasure to introduce our presenter, Kelly Predmeski. Kelly is the Celestial Cruises BDM for the Southeastern US and Caribbean based in West Palm Beach, covering Florida, Georgia, North and South Carolina, Mississippi, Alabama, and Tennessee. Take it away, Kelly. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I'm so excited to be here with you guys again. And this time, um, Celestial wanted to kind of give you a more in-depth training. We've done a few CLIA webinars in the past that have all kind of been a product overview of Celestial. And today, I want to give you a more sales forward um, training on how you can really grow your business with Celestial Cruises as a partner. So with that, I will get started. Um, let's see. Again, I'm the business development manager based in the Southeast. I am in West Palm Beach, but we have an entire sales team in the US. We have four BDMs and a VP of business development. So we have someone based out in Seattle covering the West Coast. We have someone based up in Baltimore, uh, Andre covering the Northeast. And then Maria Trianto is based in the Chicago area covering the Midwest. So we have um, a support team out here for you. And if you don't know who your business development manager is, just reach out to me and I will introduce you. So let's get started. How can you see more growth with Celestial Cruises as a partner, both uh, it really in your sales and revenue? And how can you use our strong messaging to help maximize, maximize your revenue earning opportunities? So I am going to review, again, if, if you've never done a basic celestial training, I'm going to tell you the basis of what makes us a little different. And then I'm going to share with you my top five ways on how to move your business forward with celestial cruises. So about celestial cruises, we are a Greek-owned cruise line. So we are home porting in Athens, Greece, and we specialize in the Eastern Mediterranean. That is all we do. We are what's known as a destination cruise line. Um, we use mid-sized ships and how you can kind of think of those ships is as a floating hotel. We are very port intensive. We are all about experiencing as much of the destination as possible, coming back to the ship in the evening, eating dinner, seeing a show, going to bed and waking up in a new place to explore. Our excursions are incredible. They really get you into the heart of these places, bringing you face to face with the local people, the food, the ancient history. You really get with us an immersive cruise experience, which is a lot different than some of the big cruise lines that you guys might be used to selling. Um, besides Greece, which we're really known for, we are expanding our footprint into the rest of the Eastern Mediterranean. So throughout our itineraries, you're going to find ports of call throughout Turkey, Egypt, Israel, Cyprus, Italy, Montenegro, and Croatia. So we're not going too far away from home. We're still, in, we're still doing what we know best, our backyard. And we do offer three, four, and seven night cruises and a few different 14 night special one-off departures. Um, and at this point, we're pretty much operating year round. Um, we are also all inclusive. So your clients don't have to worry about any of the big stuff and you don't have to worry about trying to upsell the big stuff. We've already included it for you. So we're including unlimited drinks in our cruise fares, beer, wine, liquor, it's all included. We're including shore excursions, select shore excursions and all the port fees and gratuities. So your clients are automatically gonna have an amazing trip and not have a huge bill at the end, which is really nice. Another thing about us is that Greece, the destination, is truly having a moment. If you're reading any of the travel media, Greece is constantly in it as a destination that is hot right now. So we are like the, a great partner to be familiar with so you can capitalize on these opportunities quickly. Um, I was just at the New York Times travel show this past weekend 
and the tourism board of Greece had one of the largest booths at the whole show. They were one of the headline sponsors. So they are really investing a lot in the North American market and it's working because US travelers to Greece are growing year over year tremendously. So again, this is a really good destination to familiarize yourself with, which is why you're here. So I'm excited to have you. So let's move on to my tips and how you can truly grow your business with Celestial Cruises. Um, as you grow as a travel advisor, you want your clients to grow with you. So if you're used to selling some of the more mass market cruise lines, maybe Caribbean cruise lines, maybe all inclusives, eventually you want to continue showing your clients your value and your expertise. And by partnering with a niche cruise line like Celestial Cruises, you're truly showing them why you're the expert. Because without you, they wouldn't know about us. We don't have a lot of brand awareness in um, with consumers here in North America. So it shows that you have amazing partnerships with unique suppliers that deliver the most authentic experiences in specific destinations. So it really gives you more credibility. And as you introduce more interesting destinations, what are kind of seen as exotic destinations, your clients start to need you more and more as they go further away from home, right? And a lot of times when they start traveling this way, that means they're going to start spending more money too. Um, so this is a great way introducing your clients to niche suppliers like Celestial Cruises. Um, let me show you an itinerary that you can use. If you have clients that like to go to the Caribbean, for example, why do they like to go there? It's sunny, the people are nice, the beaches are awesome. Well, guess what? Greece has some of the best beaches in the world. Greek hospitality is what they're known for, the people of Greece are some of the warmest people in the world. And this gives an added element of being a more culturally immersive type of experience. So they get to see things maybe they, they wouldn't normally on some of the trips that they started off doing. It ups the ante, right? You take them to the next level. On a trip like this to the Greek islands, we go to Kusharasi, Turkey to see ancient ruins of Ephesus. We go to the island of Rhodes to see medieval architecture, citadels sitting up on the Acropolis of Lindos. We go to the island of Crete, which is where the first civilization on the entire continent of Europe comes from. But then we are also going to these amazingly sunny places like Santorini, Milos, and Mykonos. Milos is one of those hidden gem destinations that they most likely haven't heard of. Um, and you can really show your destination expertise. Milos is the place a lot of people come back from and that ends up being their favorite because they have no idea what to expect. Milos is all about the beaches. Um, you can see some of the included shore excursions that we have on this itinerary are fantastic. We have itineraries that allow your clients to grow with us as well. So maybe they start off dipping their toe in the water doing the Greek islands. Say they really like it and they want to up their travel game. Well, our itineraries are designed for a traveler in mind. So we go more off the beaten path. Like we can take you to places like Istanbul, Chinakali, where the ancient city of Troy is, um, Volos, where you can go to those magnificent monasteries perched up on the mountains, on the limestone cliffs in Meteora. And then if they want to take it even further, our, our three continents cruise goes from Athens to Egypt to Israel, Cyprus, Rhodes, and Kushadasi. So as your clients grow and become more sophisticated travelers, using a niche cruise line like us can really help get them to the next level, which also takes your business to the next level. My second favorite tip, we truly have unique USPs, and that is stands for unique selling points that you can use to convert FIT travelers into first time cruisers. So before we talk about what our actual unique selling points are, let's talk about what happens when you convert an FIT traveler into a cruiser and what the actual impact is on your business. You're spending less time researching because FIT traps, 
FIT tri uh, trips take an awful lot of time to research and piece together. All time you could be using to close more sales. Less time is spent booking on multiple platforms. When you're piecing together an FIT trap trip, you are working with multiple vendors. You have to make sure it all lines up. You have to make sure that you make no mistakes with the dates or everything could fall apart. Um, you have to learn what the, how to use the different platforms that all of these different vendors have. Um, when you're putting an FIT traveler onto a cruise, you're dealing with way fewer terms and conditions to track, which means less liability for you and your clients if something happens with their trip. When you use a one-stop shop supplier like Celestial Cruises, you are ultimately freeing time for yourself, which means that you can take on more clients, which means that you can earn more money. So if you can uh, become a more savvy salesperson to convert your FIT travelers into first-time cruisers, you are going to make more money. Um, and by supporting your preferred suppliers like Celestial Cruises, Ultimately, you're going to earn more because as we grow our sales with your company in general, Oasis and Palm Coast Travel, it actually allows us to pay all of you an even higher commission. So over time, you are going to continue to make more money with us. It also means your clients can have a better, smoother experience from a reputable company that you have a relationship with, and that means they're more likely to return and turn into repeat clients and refer other new leads to you, right? So let's talk about Celestial's specific un uh, unique selling points. We have some incredible overnight stays in Mykonos, Santorini, and Istanbul. Because when you go to places like this that your clients have been waiting to go their entire life, being in port from 10 a.m. till 5 p.m. is hardly enough time. Um, we are in Mykonos for 24 hours from 7 p.m. until 7 p.m. the next day. We are in Santorini from 7 a.m. until 2.30 in the morning. And on our eclectic itinerary, when we overnight in Istanbul, we are in port for 28 hours. You need time to explore these places more in depth. There's so much to see. Um, but what is in it for your clients? Well, we just said they get more time to explore, but also they can do it on their terms. They don't have to feel rushed. They could go rent a car and explore the island of Santorini if they want. They get to um, be more independent when we give them this much time. Um, if you are converting an FIT traveler into a cruise, how do you do that with us? Well, guess what? Staying on the island of Mykonos in July is really expensive. You can look at $1,000 a night. With us, when you're using the ship like a floating hotel, you can spend all that money on actually having experiences and creating memories. You can treat yourself to a really nice meal. You can go out on a boat to go around the islands for the day. You're not spending all that money on a place to sleep that you're not going to be in except to go to sleep. And you're not missing out on the nightlife of these destinations. Mykonos has legendary nightlife. Istanbul is a huge city. It's the fourth largest city in the world. It has tons to do at night. And you don't have to miss out on that part of the experience in these destinations. And these are all things that are important to independent travelers that you could potentially use to convert into first-time cruisers with Celestial Cruises. The next thing about us, we are Greek. So what's in it for them? Well, you get a more authentic experience and it's more culturally immersive. We take a lot of pride in showing them our backyard. We're not trying to keep them on board a ship. We actually get to show them the destination. The ship is not the destination with us. Um, the picture on the left that I took this picture, this gentleman's name is Vasilius. I call him a living legend. This is one of the optional shore excursions that we offer on the island of Crete. Let me give you an example. We actually take you out into the countryside in Crete because Crete is a very diverse place. It's one of the largest Greek islands. It has mountains. It has vineyards and olive oil field or sorry olive fields um, it has beaches it has the city center of Heraklion with amazing shopping but 
this is my favorite excursion that Celestial does. We take you out into the countryside to meet this man, Vasilius. Him and his family own a, a vineyard and make wine um, there on the island of Crete. But this vineyard has been in their family for generations, and it's so important to him and their family's legacy that they keep it going. So he teaches you all about the role the vineyard has played in their life and in their family, about the winemaking process on the island of Crete. And then we actually go inside and we get a traditional Cretan dance performance, a folk dance performance, which is really cool. We get to drink all the local wine that he makes. We get to drink some traditional raque, which is like a post-dinner digestive shot. We get to eat traditional Cretan cheese that's made right there on the island. Uh, we get to eat this amazing Greek uh, yogurt dessert that they have with honey. So we get to try some of the local foods that come specifically from Crete, drink the local wine from Crete, and see some of the traditional folk dancing that's done there. And of course, afterwards, they're gonna have uh, some nice crowd participation and teach you some of the local traditional Greek dances. This is one of my favorite excursions that we do. It really gets you into the heart of the region. And this is what people go home talking about. They remember Vasilius because this man is captivating. Another thing having to do with us being Greek is because we're specializing in this region specifically and we know this region the best, we get them into the heart of this place. We go off the beaten path beyond Mykonos and Santorini, showing them the hidden gems of our region, which really with like a more independent traveler gives um, us a lot more credibility as being able to offer an immersive experience. So this is the type of special experiences that FIT travelers are really looking for and are afraid that they're gonna miss out on it when they do a cruise. But with us, this is exactly what they're gonna get. <clears throat> we have mid-sized ships. So what's in it for an FIT traveler? We have a smaller, cozier onboard experience that reflects the destination. It's not a huge mega ship. Um, we are bringing the culture of Greece and the Mediterranean into the onboard experience through our food, through the entertainment, through cultural lectures. With us, we even have an immersive experience on board. One of the things I really love that we do are cultural lectures. In the port of Chinakali, Turkey, on our eclectic itinerary, we actually have a Fulbright scholar come lecture on the ancient city of Troy before we arrive in Chinakali. That's pretty incredible but we have that cozier onboard experience with a classic style ship that acts like a floating hotel. By using these smaller ships, we're taking them to places that the big guys skip. And like I said before, in their eyes, that gives us more credibility with, with someone that has a traveler mindset. So I wanna take a quick side note because in order to be able to connect all these unique selling points to the needs of someone who thinks they're an FIT traveler that you're trying to convince to take a cruise, you need to have a really persuasive, persuasive selling statement when you present these features to them. So you can do this using the formula, which is called FAB, which stands for Feature Advantage Benefit. So you take the feature or the unique selling point, for example, that we have overnight stops, or really any component of one of our cruises, and you can use this obviously with any product you're selling, then you take the advantage, which is what that feature gives to your client or what that advantage does for your client, and you create the benefit for them by saying, which means that. So let's take an example for the overnight stop in Mykonos. So this cruise actually overnights in Mykonos, you get plenty of time, 24 hours to spend there, which means that you don't have to miss out on anything you want to do and you still don't have to pay for a hotel. You see what I did there? So when you use a fab statement, you're actually creating value by solving a problem or need, which then creates more buy-in from your client and makes it so much more likely for you to close that sale. So that is just a favorite selling tip that I wanted to share with you. My third favorite tip on how you can truly grow your business with Celestial Cruises is that selling a cruise line like Celestial Cruises, being all-inclusive, you're automatically gonna make more. We're not making you work for the sale 
by having to upsell all the things that your clients actually need for their experience. So we're including three meals a day on board. We're including an unlimited drink package, beer, wine, liquor, coffee, soda. On our seven night cruises, we're including three shore excursions. It's huge. We have entertainment every night and all the port fees and gratuities are included. You're automatically making more commission by having the drink package and excursions included. You're not having to fight for that sale. The fourth way, groups. Everyone loves groups. You can make a lot of revenue doing groups. And with a destination like Greece that's so hot, this is a great way to grow your business if you're only just starting to do groups. Um, groups can truly transform your business. But not only that, when you do more groups, it also helps you grow your FIT business because if you have someone travel with you in a group, you can then continue to remarket to them and get them as FIT clients. So what types of groups are traveling with Celestial Cruises? We're getting Greek families who wanna go explore their Greek heritage. There are some really big cities all over this country that have a lot of Greek heritage. We're getting bucket list travelers who maybe are retired, again, retirement communities who are traveling all over the world. We're getting pilgrimage and religious groups because a lot of the destinations that we go to have a biblical um, history there. We're getting educational groups. Everyone learns about ancient Greek um, history and culture and ancient sites and schools. So if you have a graduation trip for a high school that you have ties to, or college groups, um, spring, like, you know, graduation trips from college. And we are starting to see more yoga and wellness groups cruising with us as well. Greece is a huge destination for that. We actually just announced last week that we're partnering with a local Greek chef on one of our itineraries, the seven night eclectic itinerary. Her name is Diane Kochilis. And she has a cooking show called My Greek Table on PBS. And so we're going to be having a special departure on October 10th. And she actually specializes in the Blue Zone diet. She has a cooking school on the small island of Ikaria. We don't go there. But this is considered a Blue Zone in the world. And there are designated Blue Zones throughout the world where people are known to live a lot longer because of the diet in the region. So she actually special, uh, is very well known for cooking in the blue zone. So on board that departure, we're gonna be having culinary culture um, lecture sessions, cooking demonstrations, and special um, culinary excursions that we're gonna be offering in all of the different ports because all of these different ports also have their own food traditions. So we're getting um, a lot of different types of groups cruising with us, and this is one of them. So let's do the math on if you are actually trying to do groups and um, in your business in 2020. The average cost for a person on a seven night celestial itinerary is around $1,600. So say if uh, the average commission might be $200 per person. If you have 20 couples, so 40 people, you're gonna make $8,000 in revenue on a $64,000 sale, and that's just for the cruise only. A lot of agents are gonna package that with pre and post hotels and tours. I mean, you still have flights, travel insurance, optional shore excursions that you can make commission on. Say you did four groups per year, you're looking at $256,000 in sales minimum. And what if you got 25% of those people to use you for a second FIT trip that year. You're looking at 40 new FIT customers. So this is just one way of growing your business and capitalizing on a destination that is extremely hot and in the spotlight right now. So where do you start with trying to get groups business for this destination? Well, guess what? Almost every city in America has a Greek festival and this is an amazing no-brainer place to start. So how do you do this? I'm gonna give you some steps, so like a blueprint to trying to get a group with Celestial Cruises. What I would do is I would go to this community. Most of the time the Greek festival is put on by a Greek Orthodox church. 
So I would try to find the influ influential person in that community it, responsible or involved with putting on the festival. I would go there several months before and try to, and request a meeting. Do they want to continue the celebration of their Greek heritage in the destination and promote a group for the community to be able to travel together just for fun to go back to their roots? You're going to open group space with Celestial by emailing me. We have a commercial assistant who handles all of our group booking requests who I'll introduce you. To. Her name is Sandra. Uh, we're going to block this space for you. And then what I would do is I'm going to promote the group uh, at the festival at your booth, which you're going to want to get. I would have collateral that I can partner with you on. All of your BDMs can partner with you on. Maybe a postcard would be good to hand out or a flyer that is going to have a follow-up travel talk. So I would host a travel talk with, in partnership with the, the Greek community, um, maybe hosting it at their Greek church um, for people who are interested to learn more. I would also be collecting data at the festival so that you have the email data to, to blast with the follow-up travel talk invitation. Um, you're going to really want to get this leader invested as well. They're kind of like your Pied Piper who is going to engage everyone and make them excited. They're going to be someone that the community wants to travel with. So then I would host the travel talk and of course Celestial will work with you to create an exclusive offer. What I normally do is create a two week um, window after the travel talk so someone could potentially get special onboard credit if they put a deposit down within two weeks of the travel talk. So this is a general blueprint um, that you could follow to start getting groups with Celestial Cruises. And the final way that you can grow your sales with Celestial Cruises is, that's me. You can really need to utilize your BDMs. We are here for you. Um, we are not just here to help solve problems. We are sales savvy people who have a lot of industry experience. If you want to call your BDM to brainstorm how you can grow your sales with us, we love those phone calls. We want to help you create a plan. And if you're struggling, I get I just talked with an agent a few weeks ago who said she ran a report on all her most popular destinations and that Greece was the worst one. Yet she receives a ton of inquiries, but she has problems closing the sale. We want to hear from you on that. We want to know what objections you're hearing so that we can help you overcome them. So truly use your BDM. Um, like we're your teammate we only win if you win so we are here for you and this is a great way we're here to help you grow your sales <laughs> i'm free it doesn't cost you any money so that's it let's like recap here introduce your clients to niche suppliers so that their travel style progresses over time they become more savvy travelers which generally brings you more revenue use um our destination I driven itineraries and unique selling points to convert FIT travelers into first time cruisers, which generally means you're spending less time and making more money, creating time to take on new clients. Uh, make more when you sell our all inclusive product. You can use us to grow your group's business. Right now, our destination is in the spotlight, so people want to go here. And really, we are your best resource and your biggest advocate. Um, we are here for you no matter what as your BDMs. I want to tell you about an exciting travel um, trade incentive we have going on. It actually was supposed to end January 31st, but I just found out today that we extended it through the end of March. So this is pretty incredible. If you sell five staterooms on any of our seven night itineraries made um, by the end of March 31st, um, sailing in 2020, you can earn a free cruise, a free seven night cruise for you and a guest from Celestial. So any of our seven night itineraries in 2020 qualify. If you sell five, you can pick from the eclectic, the three continents, or our new itinerary, the romantic Adriatic, to sail in 2020 or 2021. So this is an amazing opportunity for you to make some sales using our current wave promo, which is incredible. 
and getting to experience Celeste yourself. It's just, it's not valid on group bookings. So this is for individual FIT bookings only. And that's it, Efaristo, it's a new Greek word for you. Um, I'm excited to answer any questions you guys have. Perfect, thank you. We do have some questions coming in. Our first one is from Dana, who is wondering if you offer future cruise booking while on board, and if so, does the original agent get commission on those future cruises? We don't currently offer that. Okay. Our next question is from Chessine, who is wondering if you cater to accessible travelers on board and on shore. So this is um, always an interesting question because yes, our ships are accessible, but the, the thing is, is because our, our itineraries are so poor intensive and these destinations we're going to are very old, <laughs> um, it can be challenging for people who have mobility issues, especially when we're having to tender in certain ports. Um, travelers need to be able to do the tender with no assistance from our crew, um, so that can be a little challenging. Places like Santorini and Mykonos, it's narrow, cobblestone, steep streets. So it it would be very challenging, I think, for people with mobility issues. Okay, got it. Our next question is from Wendy, who is wondering if you have an image or video library that they can use for collateral. Yes, we do. Um, we actually have uh, an agent Facebook group called Celestial Cruises Agent Talk Americas. And we post um, all of those types of things and login details in our Facebook group. So Celestial Cruises, Agent Talk Americas. We have a lot of marketing assets in that group. Okay, perfect, that should be easy to find. Our next question, we have some people wondering how they find their BDM. Yes, so if you want, you can email me, kpredmeski at celestial.com, and I will introduce you. Perfect, also very easy. Dana is wondering if any of your itineraries include flower events that she could market to flower society groups. Uh, that's a very specific question. Um, not that I know of. Okay, perfect. And Wendy is wondering where you do the tenders. Um, we do them in Santorini, in Milos, and sometimes we dock in Mykonos, and sometimes we have to tender. Okay, perfect. And can you just repeat the Facebook group again? Is it Celestial Cruises, Agents Talk Americas? Agents Talk Americas, yes. I will just type that in for everyone. Okay, and it looks like that was our last question. So thank you so much, Kelly, for all the wonderful information, and thank you, everyone, for joining us. Thank you so much. Take care. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.